pharynx, esophagus, stomach, duodenum, jejunum, ilium, cecum, ascending, colon, transverse, descending, rectum, and then your anus. And then here is on your stomach, you have your fundus, the pylorus, pyloric sphincter, esophageal sphincter, and rugae. And then you have your duodenum, and these are called plicae circularis. And then mesentery. This yes, your mesentery. <laughs> <laughs> this line is called Tinea coli. <laughs> coli. And these sections are called hustra. This is your hepatic flexure, splenic flexure, and then your sigmoid colon. Flexure. Flexure. <laughs> what else do you need to know? I think that's it. Appendix. You, oh, your appendix. Ooh, very important. You have to say this stuff. Put the gallbladder in. <gasps> This is your gallbladder. This is your common hepatic duct, cystic duct, your common bile duct. And this is still your common bile duct. This is your pancreatic duct, and then it goes into your duodenum to make a duodenal ampulla. Yeah. <laughs> what else do we need to know? This is something, but I don't know what it's called. What? Ileocecal valve? Yes, that's it. Ileocecal valve. Okay. Even though it's not on my little list, no. Okay, we're done. <laughs> Are we done? Yeah. I feel